Hello and welcome. In this short video, we will discover and review the features available within your PhoneLine Plus account. To log into PhoneLine Plus in your web browser, navigate to app.phonelineplus.com. Once you are here, sign in with your email address and password. Should you need to set a new password, you may use the Forgot Password option below. After signing in, you will be greeted by the dial pad. From here, you can make and receive phone calls, provided you have given the website permission to access your microphone. To dial a number, simply click on the dial pad or type in the entry box above, as shown. The drop down menu below allows you to select the number which you would like to be presented to the callee, if multiple are associated with the account. When you are ready to place your call, press the purple phone button. Several options are available whilst a call is in progress, as you might expect. If you would like to view your contacts, or add another, select the contacts button here, as shown. The final button in the group allows you to change your audio devices, useful if you plan to use a headset for calls. On the left is your call history. This can be filtered using the menu here, where a notification toggle also exists. Moving into the settings menu, we have several options on the left. From the top down, we first have a page showing all phone numbers assigned to your account. Here you may select a default number for outbound calls. Next, and perhaps most importantly, we have call handling settings. Here you can tell the platform what to do with unanswered calls, set out of hours behaviour, and more. If you wish to apply a personal voicemail greeting, you may do so here by either recording a new message, uploading an audio file, or selecting an existing greeting from your library. We will discover the library later. If you wish for unanswered calls to redirect elsewhere, you may select another Phone Line Plus user from the list here, if applicable, or add an external user for off-platform diversion using the final option. Two tick boxes here allow you to choose which number is presented to the redirect callee and have these calls announced by a pre-recorded greeting, if desired. Don't forget to adjust the ring time to a figure which suits you. The out-of-hours settings allow you to configure the platform to handle calls differently during different times of the day or days of the week. For example, you may wish to be unavailable all day on the weekends, with specific working hours during the week. Incoming calls outside of these hours will be handled according to the options selected below. These are identical to the options covered above, though you may wish to apply a different greeting here so callers may be advised that you are not currently accepting calls. Note that you can activate out-of-hours behaviour anytime by setting an unavailable status as shown. The next option covers calls to premium and international numbers. If you would like these features enabling, please speak with your Pink Connect account manager. The final feature on this page allows us to select hold music for calls made or received using this account. Please make sure you have permission to use any audio that does not belong to you. The next page, Devices, shows all devices logged into your Phone 9 Plus account. These may be mobile devices or the Phone Line Plus web app, as we are using now. Selecting these devices gives you a few device specific options, including the option to forward calls elsewhere if a single device is offline. Here you may remove a device, signing it out of your account. The toggle to the right allows you to prevent a specific device from receiving incoming calls, if desired. If you would like to divert all calls to an external device, such as a mobile phone, without allowing calls to ring on Phone Line Plus, you may do so by selecting Add a device here. Simply enter the external number here and select Add device redirect. The next page, Sound, allows you to change ringing volume and audio devices. The Recordings page contains your library where the platform will store audio to be used for voicemail greetings or music on hold. 
Select the purple button at the top of the page to add audio to be used elsewhere. The notifications page allows you to enable or disable email notifications. These will notify you of missed calls and new voicemails using the email address associated with your account. This email address can be changed, if required, from the profile page where you will also find options to set a new password or change your address. It is important that your address is kept up to date as this information may be available to emergency services. The final four pages are available only if you are logged in as an administrator. The first of these allows you to view, add and remove user accounts. You may also apply some call settings specific to each user account. The numbers page shows you all phone numbers across your associated Phone 9 Plus accounts. The privacy page allows you to block unwanted callers and global settings provides the option to change your company name or apply account wide hold music. That covers the settings. Before we say goodbye, let's take a quick look into analytics. These pages show us statistics for inbound, outbound and missed calls with results viewable by the hour, day, week or month. You may also view activity specific to users or phone numbers if you wish. If you would like to generate and download a CSV report, you may do so on the final page. That's all for this tutorial. We hope you've gained a comfortable understanding of the features available within PhoneLine Plus. Please experiment with these if necessary and take the time to set up your account in a way which works best for you.